Energy Transition Dialogues in early November was a platform to explore realistically what it means to walk the talk of energy transition for the global south. The many panels and discussions featured representatives from the government, both Indian and foreign, investors, power companies, philanthropic organizations and more. Each discussion talking about implementing new solutions for the utilization of renewable energy resources aiming for a people positive energy transition in the global south and there was another key stakeholder innovators so you have innovators who work uh, early stage or who work uh, at a later growth stage but the gap in between where also most of the valley of death happens and where startups you know begin failing and innovators begin failing is because they don't have that access to a series a funding which is the capital second the mentorship programs i think that is not structured while we again have market linkages um we might have products which are ready um to be launched at the market but not at scale so that is another gap that we found out when we did our um market research so the idea of entice was to create this one shop platform uh where we could a give them access to investors and investors coming into climate tech is not the easiest space that they would want to invest in because of the risk perceived risk so the market linkages the investor linkages and also the mentorship entice is an initiative powered by giap that's incentivizing innovations at a scale for energy transitions Entice or Energy Transitions Innovation Challenge is an annual competition to accelerate India's progress towards its sustainability goals by developing new strategies, models and approaches driven by innovation. Organizations and individuals who are in the space of clean energy innovations were invited to participate in this competition. The Entice winners were announced during the Energy Transition Dialogues in early November. So Cancrete comes in as a carbon solutions company. each and each and every battery needs certain kind of carbons there what we are doing is very simple we take the waste apply a patented process and convert to the advanced nano carbons these nano carbons when goes inside the batteries we get high performance and that's it high performance means high efficiencies and also better life cycle so we are to solving two problems one is we are giving second lease of life to the waste plus at the same time we are also increasing the life cycle of the batteries there were other ideas as well that were given mentorship and the space to meet possible investors in this 3 day event uh the idea is using a mix of new and second life ev batteries we want to create the lowest levelized cost of storage for any application the challenge really is that when you uh, have two batteries of varying health uh sometimes it's not easy to get them integrated into one system so what we've done is we've built some technology that balances out all of this in real time yes so our solution revolves around having larger penetration of renewable into the grid by addressing the variability problem so we use a lot of ai and grid automation to understand renewables energy grids better uh the extension of that is what uh, entice enabled us to create for example Uh, renewables come with a lot of variability into the grid and if your demand remains uh, inflexible you cannot have a lot of renewables into the mainstream grid thereby it compromises the entire decarbonization journey as well as investment landscape around renewable so our solution enables grid flexibility from the consumer side and entices uh, kind of uh, pushed us to uh, co-create a solution which can cater to uh, demand response as a problem in india Uh, we are building long duration energy storage solution as we are talking about net zero means that we can power ourselves 24/7 on clean power which is solar and wind but it's highly unsustainable because solar is only available for certain part of the day and wind is not there all the time so we are we need a long duration energy storage that can charge during the daytime and discharge 8 to 10 hours in the night and if you are able to develop a battery technologies that can sustain it in a cost and efficient manner then you can achieve a net zero by renewables so our firm is building that enabler with strong investor linkages key industry connections and personalized mentorship from industry veterans 
deeply ingrained in the energy sector. The crucial support provided by GAP through the ENTICE program is not only unearthing innovative solutions to a critical energy transition, but also giving them the space to truly revolutionize the energy landscape.